somebody wants to um, make you look like some weirdo, they would they would call you a morphe. I think that was always the go-to word. I was in church and there was this girl that was interested in me and some of my friends were like, why aren't you going for her? Like, what's wrong with you? And, and he asked me, is he a morphe? And he just said it, not because he had any reason to say it, but that words just hit me so hard. And I was like, can they maybe see it or what? And like literally the day or two after that, I actually made contact with the girl just to try and show them that I'm not gay or morphe. And that's the first time it hit me in the face, like, okay, this is who I am. And I was so scared that they could actually see who I am. My whole life was my basically kerk. Maanda, bid hier, donderdag muziek oefening, vrijdag aan de jeug, zondag twee dienste. En die kerk was eigenlijk half my, my comfort zone. Dus die plek waar ik een beetje veilig gevoel het. Toe my pastoor toen uitvind, ek is gay, het heeft my gesê, hoor jy maar, die sien van die heren gaan onttrek van jou leven, jy kan nie so leven nie, jy gaan hel toe gaan. En dit is waar my journey begin het om, om te sê, wat ek wil nie hel toe gaan um, in die hemel mis, om rede ek gay is nie. So, en ek voel dat ek is nie, ek het, ek het nog nooit die kiese gemaakt om gay te wees nie. A lot of people come with very hateful things on social media, um, and then they always justify it with a Bible verse. You can't say, I'm Christian, but I want to judge you and I want to, to kill you. You must be stoned to death, all those kind of stuff. So for me, that was a, a, a big struggle to try and um, to, to accept these people's view, but they come from a, a point of hate. If somebody comes up to me now and say, Morphe, then it doesn't affect me as bad anymore. But I think there's a lot of people out there, they still get hurt if they hear this word. It's a word that everybody knows now. But I think the word morphe itself will obviously just let people start thinking again. And I think it's the right time to maybe to bring out these kind of movies. People must know our stories. People must know our hurt. So maybe it will shock them. Maybe not. Who cares?